Hello and welcome to That Has United, the one stop for everything Manchester United. I'm here to bring you all the breaking transfer news concerning Manchester United today as according to French reports, United are among the clubs that have shown interest in Kylian Mbappe but Real Madrid remain the favourites. And also, sports owner have told Daniel Levy that she must sell Hurricane if a new deal can't be agreed. Sports 100 million valuation of Hurricane isn't said to be a major issue for United but his salary demands in the region of £30 million per year and that could prove to be difficult. But United will be in the line for Hurricane should Spurs decide to entertain offers from English clubs. But according to transfer goods Fabrizio Romano, Manchester United are not negotiating for Hurricane or Kylian Mbappe as of today, despite other reports. And our focus remains on Rasmus Hoyland deal, with official bid expected to go in very, very soon. Another name considered was Kolomoani, the French striker, but United will push again for Hoyland this week. And according to a report by Viola News, Aston Villa have joined United and Liverpool in the race to sign Florentino midfield. Sofram Amrabat. The Moroccan international has strongly been linked with the move to Old Trafford in recent weeks amid suggestion that United could attempt to sign a second midfielder this summer. Many United fans believe Amrabat would be a suitable backup option to Casemiro after excelling at last year's World Cup. Anthony Elanga has completed his medicals ahead of a move to Nottingham Forest for a fee of around £15 million and reports suggest the deal will be completed imminently. Elanga made just five starts for United last season and he last scored a goal for the club in February of 2022 against Atletico Madrid in the Champions League. We wish Antonio Langa all the best in his growing career because of course, obviously he's still a very very young player. We wish him all the best in his career and hopefully he excels and develops and become a player that some fans think he can become. Let's see how it goes. Facundo Pelestri will leave Manchester United on loan after Eric Tenag has told him that he was unlikely to be given the minutes he needs at Old Trafford this season. Pelestri has been at United for almost three years after joining from Penarol in a £9 million deal but only made his first team debut in January during our Carabao Cup victory over Charlton Athletic. The hang is in agreement with the young stars demand and a temporary exit is likely to be agreed later this month. So tell me in the comment section below, do you think it's a good idea to loan Facundo Pelleschi once again to some other club for him to continue his development or do you think he should be given a chance in the first team? Anthony Marshall has not played for United since he tore his armstring in the Premier League of last season against Farm on May 27 and Marshall is said to be eased back into team training in the coming days. Tenag said in June that Marshall's recovery would be a long one but he is, he is hopeful the Frenchman will be involved in full training this week. It is unclear if Marshall will play in either of United's remaining matches against Real Madrid and Borussia Dortmund in our preseason tour of the United States. But of course, I'm sure, sure if we were to ask players that should leave Manchester United this summer, Anthony Marshall would definitely be mentioned among those list of players. But with his injury war concerns, it's going to be very very hard to sell him. And of course, there have been links with some Saudi clubs with Marshall but that's those are not confirmed stories. I feel those are just false, um, false news. So let's see what happens with Anthony Marshall, and let's see what happens. But definitely, he's back from his injury. He will join up. He will start training with the full squad very, um, in this week. If we can get a good deal for some Saudi clubs to come and buy him, I wouldn't mind sending him and getting a, a second striker in the summer um, transfer window. So let's see what happens with Anthony Marshall. And that is all for now. Don't forget, this is Diehard United, the one stop for everything Manchester United. Do leave a like on this video and subscribe to this channel. And I will see you all on the next one.